Okay, guys, I'm so excited because it's time for stickers. We've got Jocelyn stickers for ESU. Um, here's lots of examples of student stickers and professional stickers. That's a student sticker. Whatever you're into, um, we can make a sticker out of. So you're each going to get two sheets of sticker paper, even online students. If you're interested in coming up here to South, I'll have these um, in attendance for you. And basically, you know, you cut them out and peel them off the sticker paper and they are long lasting. They are waterproof. Um, they don't bleed. Um, you can put them on your water bottle and they last a really long time. So they're pretty high quality uh, sticker paper for you. So whatever you're into, um, we can make it. So I have a template for you and it's going to have just a couple of directions, but I need an illustration to work with um, in order to do a good job at this. So I took a couple photos of things out of my sketchbook that I thought would make cool stickers. Um, I also have a logo for my husband's business and I'm gonna put my watermark on there. Um, so I'll just kind of walk you through how to, how to use the um, template and get what you want out of your stickers. Um, so bare minimum would be something like this where you have one um, illustration and you just copy paste it and align it for printing. Um, and then, you know, the other end of that is that you have four or five different illustrations. And so you get lots of different um, stickers printed. It's kind of up to you. So I go to my um, file explorer and I open up my camera in a second um, folder. And so I'm going to go like this. I right click and then I say uh, open in a new window. So we're going to pretend like this is my camera. And so I make a new folder. I'm inside my graphic design folder. I'm going to make a new folder and I'm going to call it stickers. 2021, just because I have lots of versions of things. And then from my camera, these are my pictures I took over here. Can I please move? Thank you. Um, and I'm just going to drag them off of my camera, hold shift down, and I'm going to drop them into my stickers folder so that all of my pictures are in that one spot. And from there, if you have drawings that you want to use, you're going to go to file and place. And I'm going to find those pictures. So I'm inside graphic design. and stickers 2021 and I'm going to do one at a time so I'm going to place in this face and I'll show you it's probably going to place in pretty big so I just zoom out with my alt and the wheel of my mouse and make sure to hold shift down and remember anything in that white space is what I'm going to be working with so the next thing you need to do is make sure that you embed anything that you place in Illustrator. So with our posters, some of us hadn't embedded some images and so I couldn't print them, but that's not necessarily your fault. So file place, I'm just gonna continue that for whatever I'm hoping to draw. Control Z, file place, place, there we go. And then I choose to resize it and then embed it. And I'm not going to go through all of them, but I have four things I want to do. So with this selected, make sure that it has been embedded. And then I can check this one. It's not an option. The only thing would be to unembed, so I'm good. All right. Anything that's a sketch layer is going to be on this layer, and I call this layer sketches. So at this point in the game, we're going to start titling our layers so that you can get things going. Um, and then you can take that whole layer, or you can do this individually, but you want everything on your sketches layer to be transparent. So it's all selected. I can do that 10,000 ways. But then when I go to properties, you want to bump the opacity down so that it's pretty light where you can still see what you're doing but that you'll be able to see your digital pen lines that you're drawing instead. Okay, so then you all are going to want to lock that sketches layer. Okay, you don't want 
it to move. Um, it's just there for you to draw from and later you're going to delete it. So that's basically what I'm giving you 25 points for um, is showing me your sketches for what you're going to do. Um, what I'm looking for is that they're all on one layer, that that layer is slightly transparent and that that layer is locked. You've got a file called stickers. So that's what I need you to have and before our next class. All right, thank you so much.